Joyce's Suspicions, Question and Answer Mini Story. Listen to the story several times and answer each question out loud. Joyce has lived in a small apartment in Yellville, California for the past 10 years. Where does Joyce live? She lives in an apartment in California. What is her apartment like? Well, it's just a small little apartment because that is all she can afford on her salary. She has been a secretary in a law firm for three years. Is she a lawyer or a computer engineer? Neither. She is a secretary in a law firm. She answers the phone and helps her boss with miscellaneous paperwork. How long has she been working there? About three years now. She has been there for a little while now. She hasn't exactly loved her job and she looks forward to the weekends. How does she feel about her job? Well, she doesn't really like it. She thinks it's rather boring, and she'd rather stay home and watch TV. But she keeps working just to pay the bills. Which day of the week does she enjoy the most? She loves the weekends. So I would assume that Friday is her favorite day of the week because that is when she enjoys a nice dinner and dance with her boyfriend Roy. Who likes to dance? Joyce does. She loves dancing. How often does he take her dancing? They go dancing almost every weekend. He isn't very handsome, but he has had lots of money, or so she has thought anyways. Why does she like him if he isn't handsome? I have no idea why. Maybe she just likes him because she thinks he is rich. Does that mean she is a gold digger and just loves him for his money? Well, I guess that is a possibility. Or maybe she really does love him for real. But the truth of the matter is that he has been having some serious cash flow problems in his wine business. Whose business is having cash flow problems? Roy's business. He's been having problems in his wine business because he hasn't been selling much wine. Will he be able to resolve this problem quickly? I hope so, but I'm not sure. He has had a huge debt for several months, averaging over $100,000. How much money does he owe? One hundred thousand dollars. 
He owes a lot of money. Can he pay this debt off? I don't know if he will with his business going bad. Hopefully he'll be able to find another way to make some money. So he has been in a real pinch trying to pay it off. How long will it take him to pay this money off? Wow, it will take him a long time if he doesn't improve his business soon. Why does he owe so much money? I guess he just made some bad business decisions. And with the economic crisis, it just got worse. He has tried winning some money at the casinos in Las Vegas. Does he have a gambling problem? Yes, he does. He is addicted to gambling. Can he make a lot of money there? Probably not. He may win a little, but I doubt he'll be able to make enough gambling to pay off his bills. He has lost more than he has won. Why does he keep playing then? Because he is a little crazy. He thinks that if he just keeps trying, he can make enough money to pay off his debt. How much money does he lose? A lot of money. He loses more than he wins. Last month, for example, he won $2,569.83 at blackjack, but lost $10,000 on a horse race. How much did he win playing blackjack? $2,569.83. How much did he lose on the horse race? $10,000. He has also tried playing the lottery, but without much success. Is he a lucky guy? No, he isn't. He is very unlucky and just keeps losing more and more money. When does he play the lottery? Every Monday morning he goes to the lottery house to buy more tickets. He has spent an average of $3,000 per month on Mega Millions and another $2,000 on Fantasy V. Which lottery games does Roy play? He plays Mega Millions and Fantasy V. How often does he play the lottery? He plays every single week. The largest amount of money he ever won has been $247.13. Did Roy win a lot of money playing the lottery? No. 
No, he didn't. He won very little money in comparison to what he spent. How did Roy make two hundred forty seven dollars and thirteen cents? By playing the lottery one day. He is in a desperate situation because he has borrowed some money from a loan shark. Who is in a desperate situation? Roy is. He borrowed some money and needs to pay it back. Who does Roy owe money to? loan shark. He charges lots of interest and wants his money back. It is way overdue. What is overdue? The money that Roy borrowed from the loan shark. Will Roy pay it back? He has to pay it back, or else the loan shark might hurt him. He has been too scared to tell Joyce because he is afraid that she will dump him. Will Roy tell Joyce that he owes a lot of money? No, he won't. He doesn't want to tell her about his problem. Why doesn't he want to tell her about his money problem? Because he thinks she only loves him because he was rich. He is afraid she will dump him. But since he hasn't had any money, he hasn't even invited her out to eat. For several weeks. Where does Roy take Joyce? Nowhere. He hasn't had any money to take her anywhere. Why can't he afford to take her out to eat? Because his business is not doing well and he owes lots of money. Meanwhile, Joyce has become very suspicious of Roy's strange behavior. Whose behavior is she suspicious of? Roy's. She is suspicious of the way he is acting. What does she think that Roy is doing? She thinks that he has another girlfriend. He hasn't been his usual cheery self and he barely calls her anymore. How has Roy been acting? Really strangely, he hasn't been happy. Does he at least let her know how he is doing? Oh no, he doesn't even call her to talk to her. She suspects that he has found another girlfriend and is getting ready to dump her. Who has another girlfriend? No one. Roy is a good guy. Then why does she suspect he has another girlfriend? Just because he has been acting strangely and hasn't been calling her. She has been hurt before and doesn't want that to happen again. 
How does she feel about all this? She feels really sad and a little angry too. Why doesn't she want to be hurt again? Because it was a really painful experience and she cried a lot. So she has joined him on his trips and hired a detective to spy on him. Who is spying on Roy? A detective that Joyce knows who works as a private investigator. Why does she hire a detective? To spy on Roy to see if he has another girlfriend. Why doesn't she trust Roy? Because she has been hurt in the past and he has been acting really strangely recently. Will she dump Roy if she finds out that he really does have another girlfriend? She probably would, but as you already know, he is a good guy. Will she dump Roy if she finds out about his money problems? Haha, <laughs> you'll just have to come back next lesson to find out what happens.